Sorry to interrupt. I'm calling from the Gabriel B&B. May I ask if you know Max? Hello. Anyone there? Oh, this is Emily. I'm a guest here at Together B&B. I found this number on a note right by the phone. It says emergency number. Um, here's the thing. Do you know Max? Oh my God! Thank goodness. Your brother went out and hasn't returned since then. He didn't even answer his cell phone. We have three people here at the moment. We don't really know the area, and we're running out of food. Can you come over and help us, please? How did you get in? Oh, you're Max's brother, right? Oh, oh, wait a moment. Emily, he's here. You won't believe this. He's cute. He's more good-looking than Max. I won. Ten fox. Hold on a second. Hi, I'm Nana. Thank you so much. I want ten fox. Here, let's take a picture. Sorry, I wasn't used to it at the beginning. Nana likes to take photos. She's only here for one day, and she took hundreds of photos. And she's an internet sensation. She's got tens of thousands of fans on the internet. They enjoyed her performance, and that makes sense. I personally think she's gorgeous. Oh, oh, sorry. I'm Emily, the one who spoke with you on the phone. You're James, right? Ah, I'm boiling water. Follow me. I stayed here for two days already. It's very lovely and comfortable. I like it. Two days ago, Max made us breakfast in the morning. Then he went hunting. He said we could barbecue in the evening. But it's been two days. We tried his cell phone. We, we can get hold of him. 
I'm worried. Let's go to the lobby. Please have a seat. I found your phone number over there, so I called. We really don't know what to do. It's so great that you came. Coffee tastes so bad. <sighs> Vera, this is James. Oh, James, right? You're finally here. What took you so long? I'm Vera. I told your brother the day before yesterday. I was drink freshly ground coffee in Russia. I asked him to bring me good coffee, but all he had was this instant coffee. I hope he already found what I wanted while he's gone. I forgot to ask you for your number. Here, let's exchange contact info. If I'm hungry, you will have to prepare delicious food for me. Ah, uh, yes, exchange numbers. We used to send messages to Max when he needs something. Now you have to pay attention. Oh, by the way, Max's room is on the second floor. Uh, you must be very familiar. Maybe he left behind some information for you. His room is unlocked. I suppose you have the keys. You're the man.
Yo, yo, look who this is. It's been a while. How do you know I'm here? Damn, it must be your brother. Thank you both for the help with my dad's thing. So many stuff to take care around. Hey, check out these oars. No idea where your brother found these. It's damn good quality, eh? Fuck, he's got quite a fortune with all these. Oh, really? That's why he didn't came visit these days. So he left all the BMB stuff for you to take care. Asshole. He went off partying with a chick, probably. Few days ago, he told me he's been chatting with a chick on the phone for two hours. Shit. Why didn't he just fuck her? Takes two hours too. Look around, eh? Let me know if you need anything. Need anything?
Oh, hello. You're Max brother, eh? It's James, right? Here for vacation? Wow, it's been a long time. Thanks for attending my dad's funeral last time. I'm not a chef anymore. I'm now taking over my dad's store. We have fresh products here. My brother is at the other end selling groceries. Come see us if you need anything. Where's your brother? You didn't come together? Ah, that explains. Haven't seen him in days. I think he went to the forest up north for hunting. So... Now you're looking after the BMB? Max is such a troublemaker. But don't worry, he'll be back in a few days. Anything else?
Who the hell are you? If you don't have a license, leave now. Oh, it's you. What brings you here? You still look like a kid. Stop hanging around with my brothers. <laughs> Pussy, they have no future. They're wearing fucking aprons. You should man up, you know. <laughs> you know I'm married. I'm tough guy. You understand? Do you want coffee? I'll get my little bitch make you some coffee. She's good. Susie, where did she go again? Ah, right. Here are the keys your brother left behind last time. Bring it back to him for me, will you? He hasn't been drinking here for the past few days. Is he with you? <laughs> Shit! Your brother hangs around and dig up other people's privacy. Maybe someone's up his ass, or he went off selling his scoop to newspapers, made money, and went out. Susie, come make coffee. You better watch out yourself. Let me know if you need a gun. I'll give you discounts. All right, I gotta go find that bitch. Susie, daddy's here to spank you.